what's up, man? Hey, what's up, bro? Hey, Woo! they just told me they, they have a gig. They have an opening. Really? Yeah, 9.30 today, bro. Oh, let's go. Hey, you're going to take your equipment or, so, or what? Yeah, let's go. All right, then. So, you buy pedal word. Well, and there, and Wait. then, well, you got to take your guitar, too, bro. Oh, here. No, hurry up, bro. Hurry up. Oh. Hurry up, bro. It's, it's going to be in a few minutes. Here, okay, take okay, my pedal word. Hey, you might need a second guitar, too, oh, so guitar? make sure to take that, bro. And also, they're going to, well, they need a little acoustic in here and there, so take that as well. Those are just the ends, not the, the actual cable. So, 
one of the things that I've learned with these guys is uh, when it comes to my, when it comes to cables, especially on acoustic, I like to use the the, the ends on the acoustic fields. If you have this one, it it points out. Oh. You know? okay. it, it doesn't look. It doesn't, doesn't really matter, but it does matter in the sense of image. Right? It changes the sound. <laughs> no, 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 image wise. Right? It just it, it just has the guitar. Yeah. So there's a corner. How you call this again? Right angle. Right angle and a long one. So this one goes within the yeah. The angle. Sorry. Right. Next. Uh, it's very minimal, but I have, I'll have three more things. So another thing, uh, when it's acoustic electric, uh, you always want to carry a battery. Oh yeah, that's, that's always. Important. It depends on what type of electric, but usually they always have a nine volt, nine uh, nine V uh, uh, battery. You know? So there's that. Uh, very important because trust me, you need a battery. And the last, uh, the second thing I have, the second to last is a K K. Cable. Cable. You have a cable. So a capo. Capo. So you had a capo. So with this, uh, it's it's very necessary just in case of you're like, um, if you just want you know, you're lazy to <laughs> go a little lower. Yeah. You just want to go higher. You know, you just want to hear like more uh, higher tone quality, whatever, or or just you just need it for a song. Yeah, especially in long gigs where you're playing with acoustic, it's it's so convenient to play open chords, and that is useful for that. Yeah. Especially if, if you're changing keys and stuff like that. And the most important thing in a guitar is strings. Strings. So I got uh, I play with Elixirs. They're haters. This guy plays with what? I play with Elixirs as well. Yeah. What? <laughs> so really? I'm, I'm not a hater. Oh, is this when you changed? Uh, a while back. Yeah. <gasps> oh, that's right. I've converted. <laughs> Well, only, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so elixir, I play with 12s uh, when it comes to uh, acoustics. I play uh, either 11 or 12, but uh, I've been changing up to 12s. All right. Yeah. So it's kind of hard though. But that's it. But and and, and but the, my guitar, uh, my acoustic, I, I really don't have anything else. But another thing to just to keep in mind is uh, guitar picks. That's that's yeah. important to have. You can't have enough guitar picks. You always they. They get lost, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> it's just that. Oh yeah. For some reason, we always lose them. Yeah. It's like you can buy a 12 pack and then end up with like two of them the next day. For <laughs> the some next reason. day, right? Yeah. I lose mine like within a week. Yeah. <laughs> like so. Weird. Or when you do laundry, have you ever had it where oh. you find a pick in there? Oh. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> That's every week for me. It's just like uh, I do laundry and then next thing you know, I find a pick in there. Well, <laughs> he does his own. He does his own clothes. All right. So you wash your own clothes, right? Yeah. No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do mine. Yeah, I wash mine. All right. Anyway. All right. So that's the, the more simpler end of stuff, right there. We're gonna talk about other equipment as well because it's not only guitars. I I take other equipment besides my guitar stuff. Yeah. But we'll talk about that right in a few seconds, right? So on the electric guitar end, I do local gigs. I don't do a, a lot of. Uh, I don't do any international or anything like that. Yeah. Although I do know people who, who travel with this. Oh yeah. So, but that's scary because this is a, a soft case. At the end of the day, it's still a soft case, so if you were to punch it hard enough, you can break something, right? Uh, but yeah, this is a mono case. Really nice uh, to not be hassling around a hard case. If you do a lot of local gigs, or if you want to fly on fly as well with it, a lot of people do it. I wouldn't do it. I would take my hard case if I were to travel, or if I know that my guitar is going to be in a U-Haul, I'm probably going to put it in a hard case. But and then to each their own, right? So before we get into the actual bag, well, self-explanatory, let me get this over with, right? Guitar's in there, this is beat up, <laughs> and then uh, picks on this end right there, because oh, nice. you can never have enough, right? That's the main compartment. Before we even get into the main compartment, it's always important to carry your in-ears. These are not shares, I don't have shares. I got these off Amazon, believe it or not. August got me on them, and they're all right, but I don't, really dig the EQ that much but you know they were what 20 bucks and they do the job surprisingly well so yeah always carry your in-ears 
I have them here because I I, always, I was always forgetting them on my on my nightstand and stuff like that. So now I just put them in here and use them for the gig. All right. So the top one right here. Have this. Uh, no idea what this is, a right? Birthday letter. Pretty much, yes. <laughs> I, I forgot about someone's birthday, right? Uh, microfiber, because my, I have a red guitar, so I have to wipe it down yeah. pretty frequently, right? So that's important to carry. I have. I always carry these around. This is just my personal arsenal, right? What is that? It's a breath strip. No way. For yeah, real? I carry those because I'm a coffee drinker, so and I don't like coffee breath. because I also do carry extra strings. For those of you guys who know me, I go through strings like if it were food. So that's that's not a good thing, but but yeah. A slide. <laughs> a slide because you never know when they're gonna be like, hey, we want some slide here. I don't really use it that much, but it's there just in case, right? And did I talk about it? The the capo? Yeah, I have a capo in there. Because Believe it or not, sometimes I do get lazy on the electric guitar. Not often, right? But yeah, it's good if you're doing open chords. Or if I'm using someone's acoustic, I can use the capo. All right, so that's the top one right there. Also, another thing I- Another top one. I used to carry, no, 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 wow. it's, it's the same one. Uh, another thing I used to carry in here was the Apple adapter for iPhone to, to the, oh, the, yeah. the, what is it, eight? Yeah, it's the eight, the, the millimeter one. Uh, the small one, so you can plug into to stuff or the the female side of that one. I used to carry that. I don't know where it is currently. I think it might be in my backpack there. But yeah, that's that's important to have it because well, from from what you're gonna discover later on, I do use other equipment. Sometimes I have to use my phone, which is currently recording right now, right? But I have to use it for either playing uh, music or something like that, or playing sequences. Yeah, for for the style we play, right? Alright, so the big boy, the chunky boy right, over here. Cameraman. Ta da! It's a rat's nest, right? Cables. Uh, one of them. Yeah, one of them is Mogami. And then uh, I'll tell you that the thinner one is a Mogami cable, right? Uh, I use 10 foot cables because I'm not that far from where I can plug in. And plus, I have a pedal board, so it's 10 plus 10 is 20. So I have more than enough space, right? And then the other one is a live wire one, believe it or not, with neutral ends. Oh, okay. So, so yeah, uh, I really like these ends because for for the amount of uh, use I give them, they last a lot, right? Because we're always plugging and unplugging. Believe it or not, if you play a lot of gigs uh, over the time, your the ends. I used to have a live wire one, but one of the cheaper ones, and it would always unscrew on me. So yeah, I quit that uh, a while back, right? So that's cables, guitar strap. Same thing, just that this is a chunky one, right? <laughs> uh, it's really nice, believe it or not, to have it. I used to have a thin strap, and that would kill my back and my and my neck every single time I played for long periods, right? So, yeah, look into it. Uh, what brand is this? No idea. Yeah, I know it's a bass strap. It's a, it's yeah, a bass strap. It's a bass There's strap. It's a guitar strap, too. But it, it's really nice, right? Bass strap because it's thicker. And as I said, I carry strings because I go through them like like food, right? So I am on elixirs. I'm not an elixir hater, right? I'm on elixirs. I use nines. I used to be a ten oh boy, but I'm on nines now, right? <laughs> uh, and then another thing that's really important for what I do is I have a little toolkit. I know we talked about this on the maintenance video, right? You can check that over there. Uh, there's one tool in particular I use a lot, which is a, it's a flat, a tiny flat. Uh, so the reason why I carry that is because my volume knob, since I use it so much, it loosens. So I have to re-tighten it, uh, it, you know, here and there, right? It looks like I'm breaking my guitar, but I'm not. It's, <laughs> it's just re-tightening that. So that is what is in my model case. Uh, to, to many surprise, I used to carry my laptop in here. No way. But, but I, then I started damaging the actual case, so I stopped doing that. So that's why I don't carry it in there no more. No more. Because although it protects my guitar, but this has barely any protection. It's thin as this paper, so don't do it, right? I, I know from experience, right? Don't do that. All right, so that's that. And mono case, of course. Right? So let's talk about your backpack. All right, backpacks. 
Pepins are essential. Um, you know, you could go cheap or just go uh, very expensive. So for my 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 sense, I like a little bit a bit, a bit expensive. I want there's a pepper pump underneath that. Uh, there's also a pedal board case, but that's self-explanatory to protect yeah. your pedal board, right? Hard case, soft case. Okay. So for when it comes to backpacks, I'm like very picky. Um, so I have a Samsonite, um, you know. And so the most essential is my iPad. Uh, I have this iPad uh, pocket, like literally, for my iPad, right here. Ooh. Ooh. You know, I can put my tools, uh, some books as well. He doesn't read. <laughs> you know, and then over right here I could uh, put cables, like my chargers. Oh, you uh, got so adapters in there, yeah. yeah. HDMI, I got two of them. Damn. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> when it says, here. Oh, yeah, he's returning the, <laughs> he's returning, returning my cable. <laughs> TSA uh, proof safety, you know, uh, you can just put your, your, your backpack in and they would just open it up or whatever, or you just put your laptop separately, you know. What what model uh, laptop do you have, just for the viewers? 2018. 2018, 16-inch MacBook Pro. Yes, sir. No, 15, 15-inch. 15, 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. Yeah, 15-inch. Last of its kind. Oh, yeah, the 16 is the newer one. Yeah, so if you have the 15, Try to save it up. <laughs> Try to save it. And then right here, I got my pocket, another pocket where I put my cables. Ooh. You know, such as my. This guy's got adapters, bro. You know, got a lot of cables. You know, stuff like that. And then obviously right here, you want to carry your pens and all that stuff. I'm more of a because I have my iPad. I write everything digitally. Digitally. So, uh, but if you're like more, mostly like a paper dude, uh, you know, carry your pens, all that stuff. Um, write music and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. right. Carry more adapters. Damn. You know, I know. <laughs> Why? Why? And, and most importantly, if, if you forget your. Um, oh. Fix. Well, well, it's fixed, right? Well, oh, I got the last last one. No, I'm oh, good. We're in mid video. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll oh, be that. chewing away on that the whole video. And then I, I, don't, I don't like to carry on my guitar, just in case, whatever. Yeah. Like, uh, I remember uh, my friends would be like, hey, bro, you got something for my guitar strings? Ah, uh, like, I don't know what's a kid, right? And I'm like, I got you, bro. Here. You know? Yeah, I carry one as well, yeah. And, uh, and last but not least, I got more. Oh my gosh. Nah, I'm just kidding. It's your oh, that's your picks. No, picks. <laughs> there you go. So he can bait them yeah. out and be like, so I have, oh, Yeah, I have picks in my, my guitar bags, uh, except the acoustic, right? But uh, I have a pick on my wallet, and I have picks on my backpack and my, my guitar case, my electric guitar. You know, because my electric guitar, you, you, there could be emergencies like, like, hey, bro, I need, you, I need your help right now. Do you have a guitar? Yes, I don't have picks. I got you. Uh, don't worry about yeah. it. You know? Stuff like that. You know, you just want to be like, uh, prepared. So yeah. like that. Yeah. All right, so my head, it's a bit flatter than compared to his rack. <laughs> so I do, uh, well, if you open this up right, go all the way back, um, open it up. The only thing in it right now is a calculator from a statistics class, right? <laughs> because I do use this for school. I, I take out my band, my binders and stuff like that uh, when, I, when I have to do a gig. But because I share a lot of the stuff that I use on a gig, uh, technology wise so nice. might as well use the same bag right so right now i'm specking m1 macbook pro right 11 inch better than his way better than his um, <laughs> with the apple pencil i i don't really use it on gigs per se i do use it for notes however like handwritten notes i use it along with the apple pencil because what i mostly use is my m1 macbook air which is currently recording on logic right now so i can't use that i can't show you in here i think <laughs> right here I have, no, I lost the adapter. I thought it was in there. I have a chapstick in there. <laughs> the adapter, no, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about the other adapter, the, the tiny one, or it might be misplaced. Who knows, right? But that's my bag, nothing much to it. I recently, again, started using a backpack because <laughs> once I saw the state on my case, I was like, yeah, I better not do that anymore. It's got some padding in the bottom, so it doesn't crack. But yeah, that's my backpack there. And 
That's what we used to kick, right? Self-explanatory. So I'm carrying three things. <laughs> I'm carrying my teleport, my backpack, and you carry three things. Too. Three things as well, right? Uh, when he's doing electric guitar, right? And, and his is hefty because he's got a chunky case. Uh, but but yeah, it's important not only to take the essentials, right, to be able to do your gig, but also some backup picks, strings, must-haves, must-haves, because especially if you're someone like me who rips strings. Frequently, right? And it's always on sound check. It's, it's weird. It's the weirdest <laughs> thing. Mine is before the events. Yeah, exactly. On sound checks, I'm always ripping the strings for some reason. It's like I play harder in the sound check than in the actual beat, right? But <laughs> but it's also it's very important to take those string winder, you know, slash uh, clipper. Important to take it as well as your your technology stuff. You, you know, Salvador has a bunch of adapters in that backpack. But I'm pretty Just sure in he, case. he uses them, right? Uh, chargers, four target chargers. adapters. And I have my charger, like, but if I use headphones, like I use Beats. Uh -huh. Headphones, I got the charger as well, you know? Oh, yeah. yeah. I got those chargers and, you know, just in case, you know, uh, uh, usually because. There would be like moments that I forgot, I forget a charger, or a friend would be like, "Hey, you got a charger?" Gotcha. You know? Yeah. So, yeah. So, without any more things to say, well, that's ex essentially what we take. Hopefully, you got a few ideas, you know, a few uh, tips that you can take. You know, make sure to back yourself up on on the things that frequently break or the things that you can lose, right? And, and yeah, make sure to be prepared always for your gigs. At the end of the day, practice. You know, for your gigs, it doesn't matter what you take. You gotta practice for them. So, with that being said, Salvador here and Joseph over here, and see you guys in the next one. Like yeah. and subscribe.